hello 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 my beautiful fart faces welcome back to my channel and if you're new here welcome to my channel today we have a beautiful unbagging from a diamond painting wax company called Chouette Seer this is the second time I'm filming this unboxing or unbagging because the first time around my camera died or my phone died and it didn't bother saving the video clip and I was really sad and I wanted to get this video out today which is Tuesday so yeah, let's pretend we haven't unbagged this yet, or let's just open it up and I'll show you again what it is. So from Chouetzier, and they're based in Quebec, Canada. Quebec, Rimouski, Quebec, Canada. And I like it because it's a Canadian company, which is amazing. They also do leather craft. So this is their information for their leather crafting. I got a free cover minder, just a little baby cover minder. It's a cute little heart so adorable so if you need your mo covers minded here is your minder for your cover oh it's so cute i like it it's adorable this is where the wax is from so chouette seer there is their facebook there's their instagram there's their website which where you can purchase it from and it says have fun beverly and they spelled my first name right because usually when people um write my name they don't write l-e-y so that's amazing 10 bonus points 100 bonus points for you that's really cute and on the back we have instructions on how to use the wax so step one and it's also in i should note note this that it is in french and english so you know how if you go to a grocery store in the u.s or wherever you are um and like cereal boxes just have English writing on them. In Canada, if you go to the grocery store, cereal boxes will have French and English. Like majority of our stuff that you buy in Canada has French and English. For example, just staring over here, my tape has invisible tape slash Reuben Invincible. It's probably like Reuben Invincible, 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 whatever. Canadian, Canadian speak. So in Canada, everything's like French and English. And don't ask me about French. Like I took French since grade four, grade three in school. And I also went to Quebec to study French, but I still can't speak French. Sorry, I'm a loser. And step six, which is probably the most important step in this instruction sheet is have fun, have lots of fun. And if you heard that crash, it is my cat being a bad baby. Um, so have lots of fun. Diamond painting should be fun. Okay, let's take a look at all the goodies inside. These heart containers. Um, so I have placed two orders with them previously. I don't know if they had these heart containers, but I'm excited by them. Look how cute they are. Wax, or this is peach, pesh, peach wax. It smells so good. And then I also got banana. Oh, banana smells so good. And I also got strawberry kiwi. And if you're wondering, Beverly, it looks like you got more than one banana and it looks like you got more than one peach and it looks like you got more than one strawberry kiwi. Um, the reasoning is because some of my friends are going to get Happy Meal and I'm also going to include one of these wax hearts in my 300 subscriber giveaway, which is going to be announced later this week, secretly hidden in a video. So if you're watching this, keep an eye out for um, a video later this week, probably in a whip and chap video, um, where I'll be announcing the contest and then you can enter to win. And there's some cute prizes, just a small giveaway, just to say thank you for subscribing and thank you for supporting me. So now we're going to look at how to use the wax. Because I just finished Kindred Spirit by Dreamer Designs, which is a huge canvas. It was like a hundred centimeters or something like that. I started working on this partial diamond painting or special diamond painting. This is from, I want to say like fan cells or everyday e-deals or something like that. Anyways, it's just this beautiful cat. I'm half done. I finished the bottom last night. So let us test out this wax using uh, this canvas. And I'm going to use wax that I've already opened that I've used before. So I have placed, like I said, two orders previously from this company. This one is Monkey Fart. And as you can see, I've already used some of it. Monkey fart smells really good. I don't know what it is. Is it just banana? Who knows? This is Smurf Sweat. Smurf Sweat is probably my favorite scent. I don't know if this is how Smurfs smell when they sweat, but it's delicious. This is watermelon. Watermelon is also smells really good and it's not too overpowering. And this one, I don't know what this is. This one I think is like cotton candy or something like that. But this one smells really good too. 
So let's just use Smurf Sweat. And I was using some of this wax yesterday, so I'm just going to take it out of the pen so that I can show you how I use it to refill, or how I use the wax and how I fill it. So this is Smurf Sweat from yesterday. Just going to take it out. This is probably like my favorite wax so far. I haven't tried a ton of waxes, but this wax for me personally smells the best of the ones that I have tried and I just like that like the consistency of it it's it's hard you don't have to like melt it in your armpit or stick it in your underwear or anything like that to heat it up you basically can just use it right from the container and I'm just going to scrape it along the top and then I'm just going to shove it in with my fingers just to get it packed in there and then what I do is I just press it against the table to get any excess out. And then I'll just use my finger and wipe off any excess. Okay, so we're ready to drill. Let's see, okay, I think we're doing the two symbol. Let me bring you closer, is that helpful? So with this wax, if you load it right and you press it against the table, you're not going to get any residue left on your drills, which is like something that I really like. And I didn't even pick up a thing. You may get like, it might be spurting out a little bit, spurting out, it might be spurting out a little bit from the tip. Like you can see it's kind of um, like there's some excess coming off of it, but I just literally just wipe it away with my finger. But it's nothing where it's like stuck to the drills or anything like that. And it makes that satisfying pop sound. Ah, I picked up two drills. Things, it's anxious ridden when you're doing diamond painting on camera. Stop judging me. I can feel your eyes judging me. Okay, so that's basically how you fill it. That's how you use it. Again, um, you won't get a lot of residue on your drills. You might just have to wipe off the tip. That's what she said. You might have to just wipe off the tip for some residue that spurts out. There's no way of like talking about diamond painting stuff without feeling perverted sometimes, I swear. Maybe I just need to grow up. But yeah, so that is Chouette Seer. I, let me just like do a little picture here that's thumbnail worthy. I really like their wax. I think it's great. Um, I would recommend it. It is really affordable. If you check out their Facebook page, they actually will post sale codes. So I think I got these for like 30% off or something like that. And it ended up being like under three dollars Canadian per each of these little um, containers of wax so um, they're they are pretty small like the hearts you can see like it's wide but it's they're, the hearts themselves aren't the waxes themselves aren't very thick so it will still last you a long time like I've been using this blue wax for a while and as you can see there's just like dents in it there's not like huge chunks. I just keep buying this wax because I like how it smells and I'm a collector apparently and I have issues. So if you want to be enabled by me, I would highly suggest checking out their wax. Here's their card again. So thank you very much for watching and I really appreciate you guys. Thank you so much for your support. Thank you for subscribing. If you're new here, subscribe and join the hive. All you have to do is click that red button. Until next time, I'll talk to you guys later. Bye!